today is Tuesday, May 21st, 2019, and this is the Ad Hoc Rules of Procedure, also known as ROP, Committee of the Town Council. A quorum is present. Three of the five of us are here. One said she couldn't be here, and one's probably joining us later. This is likely to be our last meeting. Um, in fact, it is our last <laughs> meeting. It's not even just likely. It was a very long night last night at Town Council, but we are dissolved as of the end of this meeting. So right now we're gonna be looking over our minutes to see if we can go ahead and finish those up and where we're going from there. So Kathy, you identified three sets and if I look in the SharePoint and or drafts, I will be able to see them right away. Right, so we have great. three drafts. So I just opened um, the draft from 4.30, April 30th, and it's labeled 2.19.4.30. And when you go to the draft rules. There she is. We just started recording so we could embarrass you. It's all good. Well, you're not supposed to rush out of those, right? That would be wrong. <laughs> okay. So, Shelanie, we have three sets of minutes to go over, and we're just opening, we're all in the draft folder, and we're opening the one from 2019. It's labeled 2019 4 30. And we'll just. And that way we're okay. just looking it over and then we'll see if we can approve them. I was just going to say, I'm taking minutes for this meeting now and we Thank can approve you. them. At the end of the meeting? At the end of the meeting. Four thirty, um, and it's the way it's labeled. This is the way you label it: two nineteen dash four dash thirty. to what, remember what we did on 430. <laughs> mm. I have no comments or changes to this. What did we decide was our convention for minutes in terms of um, one of the things that's been really hard for the town to adopt is the list of documents that was used during the meeting. Mm -hmm. And so that's normally supposed to be, according to the Attorney General's office, mm -hmm. at the end of the minutes. And so, you know, but we have our, all our working documents are like these constant working documents. So um, we were speaking before we came to order about archiving the SharePoint and making sure that the information's available on the town website under our town council. Uh, committee, but so I'm not sure how critical that is at this point. I guess I just put in a plug for we're supposed to do that. It's mm -hmm. at, it's in the law that we're supposed to list documents, but all our documents are there, and so I'm not sure if there's a quick and easy way to refer to that rather than or just pull out the title of the working document we use during the meeting that's right there listed in the minutes. Right? You always say which version we're working from. Right. I mean, those are all they are all listed here, so. I think um, that's, to me, it's a separate issue that applies across all our committees, because often with SharePoint, we're working off um, as you were in um, some of the back and forth on uh, OCA, you know, with a draft of something you were looking on SharePoint, so it wasn't posted in the meeting packets. You know, we wouldn't have posted every single edited version right. of these, so I think Margaret just needs to figure out how should someone want to see the uh, April, the version four mm -hmm. 
of right. the document that we're working on, you know, because this is moving forward. So I, it's all sitting here um, for anyone to see and stored. Right, and so that's why I'm kind of willing to just say, we're done, we're over, people aren't gonna be requesting our minutes forever afterward, and Margaret will find it. I am saying that everywhere else we go in our town council life, we need to remember that minutes have to include a list of documents at the right. end of the minutes, but we can maybe just make an exception in this particular I case. I don't understand, because they are That's uh, not on the April 30th version I have. That's the one I'm looking at. All, all, uh, uh, scaling down, it's, there's a document presented, there's a whole long list. <laughs> What am I looking at that isn't the same? Mm -hmm. What? April 30th. Oh, that is open. Yeah, the one I'm, oh, I've got open and So that's why you don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> no, we so have no idea what you're, look, look, so it has. Look, look, it's not there. We're right. on the Okay, it, it has, Bell Milne is also in this, so it doesn't show. Oh, okay, so April. So, Everybody, everybody look, this is how it looks until I open it in Word. So if I open uh, it in Word, then it maybe should. it will. The other thing is my internet connection is being very slow over okay. here. Okay, so, so mine isn't okay. open in Word, I just opened the doc. And anyway, they're all That's here. That's very funny. Yes, it is. Well, Shalani can vouch, it's not there. Okay, I'm not so making I. This up. <laughs> okay, good, then we're great. Then we're Okay, glorious. so do you want me Goodbye. to save this under the name approved in the approved? Yeah, we okay. should, and, and at the bottom of the minutes, then it should say when, or at the top, or whatever our convention is, we should say, you know, approved at such and such meeting by whatever vote. And then it should not just be approved with no approval date. On okay. So who's making that motion? I make a motion to approve the minutes from April 30th, 2019. Seconded by Paul Mill. All in favor? Aye. Unanimous. Look, look, now it's here. Uh, it's that my my, my wireless is bad, and it wouldn't it wouldn't it wasn't showing me the um, letterhead either. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like it was only loading right. part of it. Okay, Alyssa, I'm typing on the bottom, approved yeah. May 21. Yeah, that okay. works great. Then everybody knows for sure, even though they don't say draft anymore. Today's minutes are all about approving minutes of other meetings. <laughs> that works out great. As long as the motion makes everyone sign it, that we will be doing Well, hint, hint. Good plan. <laughs> See, it felt like a hint. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so what's the next set, Kathy? I'm sorry, you're still typing. The next one would be May 7 if we're moving in order, right? Yeah. I'm going to worry about moving this to the approved folder later. Great. Sounds good. <laughs> You're going to pre-write that too? I, I'm, I'm ready to so I can just upload it to SharePoint. So. <laughs> Yeah, when I clean this up, I'm going to throw out the draft versions that are in the, uh, the, fi the final versions that are in the draft folder. 
So one has to ask. I, one has what to I'm doing is saving it under a new name called approved. So once we put a little approval on the bottom, it'll get saved in this same thing, but then I can just move it up to approved. Great. I have no changes in this. Um, I make a mo I make a motion to approve the draft minutes as final for May seventh, twenty nineteen. Second. <laughs> Seconded. Seconded. By Bob Mill. Already written in? Okay. Can we take a vote? All those in favor? Done. And then are we up to the 14th? I understand. I'm asking Mandy Jo since she's already written all of this. <laughs> <laughs> Typing question. Do we need to, in these committee meetings, write who adjourned and seconded? I mean, we are making the, yeah. So legally, no, but we made a rule that said we have who made motions and seconded. Legally, yeah, there's not a, re so that's like an extra okay. thing. It, um, when it comes down to the specificity of an adjournment motion, maybe I'd turn to the person who often serves as parliamentarian, Mandy Jo. Mm -hmm. But, um, I mean, state law says nothing about having to say, but our rule says. Yeah, I don't think committees have been putting who moved to adjourn mm -hmm. in. Yeah. I think that one's just stated, right? I'm not even sure there's been notes of it's unanimous, it's just right. adjourned at. Yeah, exactly. I think we're gonna leave that in the let's not worry about it category, but it's an interesting point because it is a motion, that is true. Another clarification question for future minute noting. How do we refer to town clerk now to, like what is the short form? Like with us, we're just using Haneke, Shane, and so with her, we would say town clerk, Margaret, not to, and then just, do we refer to her as, like when we're doing, you know, who was present, so we say town clerk, Margaret, the only thing I'd say is that it depends on which purpose she's serving. Mm -hmm. So if she's there as clerk of the council, then I think it's totally fine to just say clerk with a capital C. But if what you're talking about is listing mm -hmm. her as others present, yeah. like Councilor Grusimer, then maybe it does make more sense to say town clerk because that's, that's her primary job, right? And clerk of the council is her secondary job. Mm -hmm. But like if we were quoting her yeah. down in here, mm -hmm. I'd probably just say clerk. clerk. Okay. But Margaret's fine too. It's a good point, she wears two hats. Which one's she there for? Probably grammatical errors. I surely don't tend to be channeling. Oh, I think we're, we have a 
it's yeah. it's very bizarre how sometimes it opens just like this, and the other time it, I had to save it in Word and then reopen. Question. Maybe somebody can point me out since I seem to be getting lost here. Mm -hmm. This was our meeting just last week. Yeah. This was the meeting where I agreed to withdraw the whole thing about audible demonstrations, which had at one point become not, no longer audible was the word. Mm -hmm. And when I just did a search, I could find neither audible nor demonstration in our minutes. So it must be in here someplace. So the audible's probably not in there That'll because the week before we, we had removed the word audible out. But the um, demonstrations part, I mean, I agreed to withdraw that during the meeting. That is how it ended up not in the draft we presented last night. Sorry, I started to do something and it's screwing this up. Was it 6.4 that says we already deleted that? <laughs> I'm going to fix the formatting once we all get out of this, but if you look up in revisions that we work with three documents, it should be one, two, and three. It's just not working correctly right now. I have to save it in Word and fix it. So the Wi-Fi just the Wi-Fi is crapping out. Yeah, so that's probably why. Are we ready for that motion for May 14? I'm, I'm, one, I'm, I'm concerned that we're oh, missing okay. a section on the fact that we took something out, and, yeah. and I'm wondering if that was the reference to 6A, but I'm blanking on which, which one that was. For some reason, this won't come up. So. So it's, it was 6.2, so oh. if you see a reference to rule 6.2 ED, somewhere in there. Yeah, so it was 6.2 D, and there would, had been a straw vote at council, yada, 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 and where I'm uncomfortable is that I think Okay, so six, we're in the May 14th minutes, right? Yes. 6.2, that was, we're talking about. Yeah, I mean, but it doesn't even cover the fact that something. Um, maybe just the phrase from 6.2 as we presented it last night, which had had the word audible removed and it had shown the cross out, those present shall not engage in demonstrations of approval or disapproval. So that's So, sentence. Alyssa, what are you saying? Just put the words in that we deleted here? Yes, because there's no reference to the fact that we decided to take I mean, it says remove E and leave D, but mm -hmm. I would just like to know, I mean, I'd like it to show what E was okay. because E so, is so not So maybe what, I'll, what I'll do, and night. I'll type it in after remove, are we all in the same? After remove E, I'll just put in paren, those present shall now, or does that work? 
Yeah, because because the numbering then changed, right? And so when we're looking at yeah. what we presented to council last night, E is about audio and video recordings. Yeah. Like that's so not what we deleted. So you want this language in that E is And I, I would. Oh, that's just period. Right. Yeah, yeah it was just. I would that. like someone to come up with a concise way of characterizing that because we could not agree, I agreed to stop arguing about it, which is probably not the way we want to phrase it in here, but that, and that I said that we would defer to the president's future desire to have such a, a rule added back in. And so it wasn't just that I gave up. I figured if it became necessary, and then apparently, according to the vote of the council last night, it became necessary. Okay. So I just added the words the back. So Alyssa, just tell me exactly what word you want to add where. Okay. So I have remove E, and I put paren e those present. Because and we could, you could just say because we could not agree whether this was essential. Let's put it okay. that way. Comma. President could always request such a rule be developed later. At least I hope that's what we said, since that's what I recorded could last night. What? Could recommend uh, development of that kind of rule in the future, yeah. you know, if she needed it, kind yeah. of, if she felt like it wasn't working, mm -hmm. if she felt like it would help her. Okay. So I did it, so yep, you can see the text. Says, yep, what we did present, so that's good. Okay. It's interesting, because no one saw but us, the somewhat divisive. We discussed, this is fine with me, because that's exactly what we did. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, what actually happened? You ready for that motion? I move that we accept the minutes as amended during this meeting for May 14th, 2019. Are we ready for a vote? All those in favor say aye. aye. Excellent. I don't know why we do silent votes at town council, honestly. We've always said I at town meeting. We've always said I at select board. And suddenly we just went to this. I understand how, why you have to raise your hand. I just don't have any idea why we're raising our hands and not oh. saying I. I. It's like, it's bizarre. Like we, I'm like, oh yeah, we are voting. It's just very quietly, right? Because yeah. town meeting, select board, historical commission, they all vote by saying I. Anyone want to see the draft minutes for today's meeting? No. That's <laughs> it, it's it's sure like really six good. lines. We can just look. Should Since it, the internet's crapped out, I can't just upload it. What did you write about the fact that we were dissolved? I didn't write anything yet. We should write something about that, right? That that the reason this is our last meeting oh, is I, because we were dissolved. I can so. add after adjourn, the committee is dissolved per adjourned well, at, 8 PM, at whatever AM. Yes, uh, but I think we should also add at the beginning that something to the effect of a speech where we should all be so proud of ourselves that we got through this, but <laughs> whatever we want to say about that, but some statement that says we presented whichever, we presented version eight last night to the council and it was amended and voted on and then they voted to dissolve us as of the end of the next day meeting.
stuff I babbled at the beginning when we first uh, called to order. So I just added to topics not in reasonably anticipated by the chair 48 hours in advance. The statement version eight was presented, I'll, I'll add rules of procedure version eight was presented to the town council on May 20th, 2019. The town council adopted version eight as amended at the meeting, referred remaining issues to GOL and voted to dissolve the rules of procedure ad hoc committee as of the end of the ROP's May 21st, 2019 meeting. The only point I have is to not put it under topics not anticipated because we posted a meeting knowing that we were going to work with whatever happened at council last night. So it's not not anticipated that we gave them a draft last night. I mean, we knew that we were going to be coming here. What's not anticipated is that we got finished. I guess that's why I put it under <laughs> not anticipated. The rest of it was that the, right. they adopted it. Everything was referred. We and a meeting said we were going to be here today. It wasn't like we had to quick jump to, to do this because they dissolved us. Just, just where you'd prefer to have it, yes. Alyssa, so we well, can just get to the end. Yeah, yeah, it's under call to order. It could be, it would be fine okay. under there. I mean, I don't, I'm not a fan of the headings we use for our minutes, so I'm more about the content, so. But it simply was not unanticipated. Fixed. It's after members participating remotely. Sounds None. wonderful. And I have moved all of the other three into the approved folder. Uh, so they are sitting there. So if we approve this closing draft, then when you save it, it can be approved and put it in approved. Once I get the internet connection, yes, <laughs> mine still absolutely. hasn't connected so back I, up. I yeah. move to approve today's meetings as drafted by Henneke um, on 521, including wording that this is our last meeting that were dissolved because the rules draft has been accepted by the council. If you would also just add a brief comment that we are, that I'll work with uh, staff to make sure our stuff is publicly accessible. And uh, we will, including Kathy Shane, will make sure, <laughs> and Alyssa will make sure that all the approved minutes are accessible and any background documents and earlier drafts are accessible to the public. I'll figure that out with Margaret. So I guess I'm moving to accept our final minutes uh, and our closing minutes and our procedure to move forward. So, yeah, so I'll just state that I added to the end of that little blurb um, that Chair Brewer and Vice Chair Schoen will work with staff to organize access to the public of committee documents. Right, all yeah. previous, com you know, all committee documents. Right. We're done and we'll have some fancy electronic box rather than a box. So Bowman seconded the motion to approve the closing minutes. All in favor? Yippee. Aye. Aye. <laughs> One's unanimous. <laughs> okay. So motion to is adjourn. There anything else other than a motion to adjourn? Hope not, since you've already closed your computer. All right. So <laughs> uh, somebody, whoever you wrote in your minutes, moved to adjourn at I 10 didn't actually write anyone. Somebody in moved the to minutes. adjourn at ten oh nine. Do we have a we wrote adjourn at ten oh nine. Works for me. <laughs> All right. Thank you everyone. And I'm turning off the recording.